We take both uh, post-consumer and post-industrial plastics. Uh, we go ahead and pass them through an extruder and produce plastic pellets that we then use in our manufacturing product for our composite decking and our PVC railing systems. Uh, what we did for fiber on here is we installed a uh, tether track, Corbell tether track fall arrest system over their rail car. When our employees go up on top of the rail cars, whether to take uh, samples or to fill the cars essentially, then uh, we use that fall protection system to prevent any fall injuries. Their main focus was that their employees are safe and they get this system put in. If they do happen to lose their balance and fall, they've got that fall protection system to prevent any injuries. And the fact that it provides me as a safety manager reassurance that the employees are going to be safe when they're on top of the rail cars. Uh, and I know obviously that's an OSHA regulation, a federal regulation and requirement, but I still like it for the fact that the employees are kept safe. Uh, you know, I don't believe anybody needs to get hurt at any job, whatever they do here, and uh, just having that system provides me a, a peace of mind, and I'm sure that it does as well for the employees. When we came out to actually measure for this project, we realized that the uh, suspending the track from the canopy itself would actually encroach on uh, railroad uh, requirements as far as distance from the track. So we ended up having to uh, notch the existing girder beams and actually raise the track up into the uh, girder themselves. Uh, every system we do is engineered. We ended up reinforcing with some angle iron and bolts because we actually had to notch the uh, bottom part of the flange of this beam. Ultimately, we came up with a great system that was raised up to the proper height and uh, the customer was really satisfied with.